eating today? Hey, what are you guys doing after prom? I don't know yet. Well, Gary's having a party if you guys wanted to go. Um, I think Christian said he could take us. Christian who? Fernandez. Maybe we should go. Do you want to go? Um, I don't oh. think I want to go. Anything better to do? I just, there's going to be like drinking and stuff, right? Right? Just yeah. one time. Mm -hmm. Not a big deal. Who are you in? Yes. Alright. Come on, Meg. Jamie, you have a lot on the line. Yeah, I can't. I don't want to go. Alright. Well, I'll go. Alright, I'll see you then. Guys, gotta go home. My mom's home. Oh, gosh. I'll go back. Christian, I don't think you should drive. No, we got. I'm no, fine. I can drive. No, we got. No, no, I can no, drive. We have to go. No, I'm fine. Fine, scumbag. We got. We gotta go. Fine. It's not even that drive. Fine. Can we just go? Jamie, Jamie, come on. We got, we gotta go. Can somebody help here? Jamie, Jamie, come on, get up. We gotta Can go. Seriously, help we gotta go. Get back up. Get back up. Jamie, wake up. We gotta go. We can't stay here. Come somebody on. help! Kenzie, help! Do any of you? What did you do? What did you do? Guys, come I'm on, we, got, we can't stay here, guys, come on. Just, I'm calling 911. I, I didn't do anything. Yes, you, you did. You, you big bastard, you this is all your fault. You crashed into us. You did this. What do you I, I told you I didn't do drive. anything. I told you. You're my you son didn't listen. in the road, you idiot. This is your fault, you crashed into me. I'm calling 911. I should be calling the cops on you. I didn't do Fine. anything. Call the cops, you I idiot. I didn't do anything. This is all your fault, I hope you Kenzie. ride in jail. I wasn't, even, I wasn't even drinking! I didn't do anything! Talk to me! Jamie! Talk to me! Come on! We gotta go! We gotta go, Jamie! Come on! Oh my god! Oh my god! We can't stay here! Come on, Jamie! Come on! Oh my god! Kenzie! Kenzie, wake up! Wake up! Talk to mommy! Please talk to me! God, please talk to me! Please! Jamie? 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 Oh my god. What did we, you do? I didn't do anything! This was you! You're on my side of the road! How do you explain that? Oh, oh shit! The cops are coming! Guys, come on! We gotta go! We gotta go! Christian, we're not going anywhere! We gotta go! We gotta go! We can't go anywhere! Rebecca, please! Rebecca, please! Rebecca! Please. County PSP 9, I need EMS and fire here right now. We have two injuries, severe. Ma'am, can you hear me? Ma'am, can you hear me? I'm moving. Can you hear me? Oh my god. We're not moving. We're not moving, you idiot. Can you hear me? Can you hear me? No, she's just wanting to get I'll believe it. What happened? Uh, I, I don't know. Uh, she, drove, she drove into us. Okay. Man, can you tell me what happened? I was just driving down the road and he crossed the lane. He ran right into us. I can't get my daughter to wake up. Okay. Please, right. please. Ma'am, can you hear me? Ma'am. I don't know what to do. Please. Please wake up! Please! Oh my god, she's so cold! Jamie! Guys, come on! Please, Jamie, please! She's not moving! I'm not even drunk! I need help! Guys, come on! Jamie. We gotta go! Just come over here. We're not going anywhere! I didn't do anything wrong! Just have a seat, just have a seat. 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 
<laughs> we have, we have, we're EMS is on the way, okay? They're coming. <laughs> Rebecca. Where are you guys coming from? We were, we were at a party at your car. You at a party? Were you drinking the night? No, no, sir. Are you I'm sure you're not hurt? No, I'm fine. All right, you said you weren't drinking, but, no. I, but I smell alcohol I'm in your not, breath. I'm, right? not, I'm not even drunk. I wasn't okay. drinking. All right, well, I can tell by your eyes and your breath that I can smell alcohol okay. on you. Okay? I didn't do anything. All right, what I'm going to have you do is I'm going to have you perform some standard field sobriety tests for me, All okay? Right. That's fine. All right, you see my pen here? Follow my pen for me, okay? All right, I'm gonna have you perform some standard field sobriety tests for me. All right, I'm gonna have you perform what's called the walk and turn. All right, I'm gonna have you put your right foot in front of your left foot like this. Do that for me. Arms down to your side. I'm gonna have you take nine steps, heel to toe. One, two, three. And then you're gonna turn around and go back and do nine another way. You understand the instructions? Yeah. All right, yeah. you may begin. Why am I doing this? I'm not, I wasn't even drinking. Just keep doing the test. I didn't do anything wrong. Okay. This is dumb. I didn't do anything. portable breath test, okay? What you're gonna do is take a deep breath, you're gonna blow into this portable breath test for me. Alright, take a deep breath for me. Blow in, blow in it like you're blowing up a balloon. Okay. Alright, Christian, turn around, put your hands Why? Why? You I didn't do left. anything! I'm not even drunk! I wasn't even drinking! You can't arrest me! I can't go to jail! Alright, well, you're DUI, so you're going to I jail tonight. I wasn't even drinking, though! I didn't do anything wrong! Okay. I'm not even drunk! I didn't do anything! You guys can't arrest me! I can't go to jail! Alright, watch your head. Dispatch, BSP 9, one in custody, DUI. Yeah, no! No! Oh, 
I'm not the lost. I'm not the lost. I know she liked you too. You've been taken from me too soon. Stupid, stupid drinking. You had such a life ahead of you. You were going to do so many things. You were going to change people's lives. And you've been taken away from me by a stupid, stupid, stupid accident. You had gone so young, so young. You're never gonna see. You grow up, I'm never gonna see your children. See you get married. So many things you had done, you would wanted to do, you're not gonna be able to do them. It's not fair. My child is gone. Why does happen? Why does that? Why does that happen to you? You were my best friend. You were an amazing person. I'm so sorry. Drunk driving kills more than 10,000 Americans a year. That's roughly one every 50 minutes. Authorities call it an epidemic. They say that despite all the publicity, all the education campaigns, and all the advertising over the years, the number of drunk driving fatalities has not gone down. Some prosecutors have started taking a different approach to the problem, getting so tough on drunk drivers who killed people that the penalties they exact were unheard of in the past. They believe that if you want to stop drunk driving, you have to treat it as a serious crime with serious jail time. Our story begins, however, not in a courtroom, but at a high school dance in Berks County, prom, and the tragic loss of two teen girls. Their names were Jamie and Kenzie, both teens at Daniel Boone High School, dearly loved by friends and family. Jamie, a senior, had plans to attend the Honors College at Indiana University of Pennsylvania to study criminal justice but her life was taken from her when she entered the car of a drunk friend after a post-prom party at just age 17. Kenzie, a sophomore, had two years of high school left and a bright future ahead of her when her life was taken from her on her way to pick up a movie from Redbox with her mother at just age 15. We have with us now someone who knows the consequences of driving drunk all too well, Christian Fernandez. Christian was also a senior when he made the mistake of getting behind the wheel after drinking at a party directly after prom. Tell us a little bit about what life was like two years ago. I was just your typical high school senior. I excelled in wrestling. I was on the baseball team. I had lots of friends. I was just trying to enjoy high school, just working towards graduating. What was prom night like for you? It was an awesome night. I won't forget it. It was a great night I had with all my friends. It felt like nothing could bring us down. What was going through your head when you got behind the wheel that night? Pretty much what I was thinking is that 
we just needed to get to a friend's house, that we couldn't stay there, because I didn't want to get in trouble. I couldn't have my dad know that I was drinking. It's ironic, just thinking that I made that decision because I didn't want to get in trouble and just look at me now. You said look at me now. Tell us what you mean by that. What is life like now? I mean, then I just thought I had to get out of there, and I just made the decision. It was just a snap judgment, and now I have a six-year sentence for homicide by vehicle while driving under the influence, so it changed everything for me. So what could be worse than spending six years of the best of years of your life behind bars? The thing that's worse is waking up every single morning, going to bed every single night, knowing that it's my fault, that two people who were completely innocent, they had no reason to die died under my jurisdiction. It was my fault. It was my decision that I made. And I'm never going to be able to take that back. If you could tell yourself back then one thing you know now, what would you say? I'd say absolutely no punishment that I could have gotten for with my parents or whatever from drinking would have been worse than this. I would gladly take any punishment. I'm getting my phone taken or grounded or whatever I was thinking at the time. I would take that over six years in prison any time. If you could say one thing to the families of Jamie and Kenzie, what would you tell them? I would tell them that I know that a million apologies and a lifetime in jail can never make up for what I did. It can never bring them back. But I just want to say that I am truly sorry. I'm very remorseful for what I did, even though I know that two wonderful mothers are never going to see their daughters again because of one decision that I made one night. And that I'm just sorry. I try to see, but I'm blinded by the white light. I can't remember how, I can't remember why. I'm lying here tonight, and I can't stand the pain, and I can't. Start this over again So I try